sport in many ways, and the family's very much involved. Here is the two-time U.S. champion, 20-year-old Johnny Weir. I believe he's planning on trying to quad for the first time. Right there. Good revolution in the air, but a double-footed landing, unable to hold the exit edge. That can be an unsettling start. This a triple axle. Again, a rather weak landing edge. Lacking control. He may have eliminated the attempt to do a quad tonight, which he had planned because of the mistakes in the opening part of the program. of skating shows that his inconsistency has been creeping up on him he's usually been very steady very strong and very good and un you know under pressure like this he's had the bad foot which certainly bothered him at the world championships in moscow after he won his second straight u.s title he struggled to a fourth place finish and i say struggle because it was very much an effort to get through the week with that injury. And did not make it to the podium. Certainly will be in the mix come in time for the Olympics, though.
He's a very subtle skater. He doesn't slam dunk you or blast through on anything. And then when he makes mistakes in it, it kind of upsets that rhythm. And so it becomes disappointing in the final run. But he's a very capable skater. Interesting to see how different he can be than Evan Lysacek in terms of styles mm -hmm. and, and the happy skater that he is. Johnny Weir will check his marks when we come back to Tampa. U.S. champ waiting for his marks right now. A quad toe for him has been very important to include in his program. And look here how he did it and gets almost throw around but double foots it and doesn't complete it. So that was not a quad toe but a good attempt. And here on this triple axle, usually very steady form and very consistent form, but watch what happens. Skids off the edge, leaning violently in the air, the foot over on the edge of the boot, and he slips out. For technical merit. So Evan Lysacek is your leader right now. We'll see if he stays there. First set of marks, Dick, for Johnny Weir. Well, they were good marks, but it was not an impressive performance by him. There were too many major mistakes. Disappointing for him. Second set for presentation, and those are higher all the way up to 5.9. And one judge putting him in first, but not overall. It's very hard to give a high mark in that area when there have been major mistakes. Four of the five judges putting Johnny Weir into second place. And so it's Evan Lysacek who gets the win here. Lysacek wins.